Welcome to another Keyshot Quick Tip. This video demonstrates how to replace and update existing textures and labels in your scene to help streamline the material setup process. This technique is very useful when making tweaks and adjustments to your texture and label files, and also when creating graphical color variations. As you can see, we have a bike frame with a graphic applied as a color map, which took some adjusting of scale and positioning to get it in the desired location. Let's say we decide to flip the halftone pattern on the lower graphic so that the darker blue is closer to the Keyshot logo. We could make changes to our image file and reapply the texture or label by dragging and dropping onto the part, but this will require us to readjust all the mapping parameters. Instead, we can update the texture or label with one click. As long as the file is saved out with the same name. Simply select the texture or label and click the reload icon. In a similar fashion, we can very easily create color variations. I'll use the pattern tool to make a couple instances of the model, reducing the spacing to zero so the lighting is consistent on each variation. Now we can show only one model and drag and drop a new material from the library while holding Alt to retain textures or Control to retain labels. Now with the texture or label selected, click the load texture icon or double click on the swatch to select your color variation and it will load perfectly into place. Understanding how to use features and functions like load and update textures will enhance your rendering workflow and expand the possibilities of what you can create. Find more helpful Keyshot quick tips and tutorials at keyshot.com learning.